Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel and my two minute review of Knives Out. Now this film is written and directed by Ryan Johnson. And to put this mildly, I was disappointed with what he did with The Last Jedi and the direction he took Star Wars. So I was curious to see what he would do without the burden of a large franchise. And all that being said, I enjoyed this movie. Now in the beginning, the film does seem to be a bit pretentious and the mood setting with the uh, violin solo is a little overbearing. Now towards the middle of the film, you may find yourself a bit bored, but that's because you think you have it figured out. But because of the clever writing, you actually don't. Now there's a political argument in the middle of the film that is useful in flushing out the characters. But the dialogue was so on the nose that I couldn't help but roll my eyes. I mean, you could have just had a sign that said, Trump supporter, Trump hater. You know? So if you're someone who wants absolutely zero politics in your movies, well, this may be a deal breaker for you. And for the most part, all the characters seem to be flushed out. They're, they're unique. You know, they, they have their own personality. Now in sort of the typical whodunit style, everyone seems to have a motive for the murder. But there is a significant reveal in the first third of the film that really sort of changes your perspective. And after I finished the movie, I thought that that was actually a good choice because it added a, a layer of sympathy that you have for a character that otherwise wouldn't have been there because most of the people in this film are, are pretty despicable. And when we're talking about a, a whodunit, a murder mystery, the writing is really crucial. It's key to keep the audience engaged and to keep you guessing till the very end. And I feel this script really accomplished that. And because Ryan Johnson both wrote and directed this film, he deserves the praise that those two positions deserve. So if you're a fan of murder mysteries, you should definitely check out this film. It's got some suspense, it has some laughs, uh, and it really keeps you guessing till the end. Now as to why Ryan Johnson couldn't pull off a good Star Wars film, I'll save that for another video. Anyway, y'all, those are my thoughts. Y'all have a blessed day, and I will see you next time.